cold drinks, that's the motherfucking recipe. Cześć, witaj, jestem Sam Max, witam Was w 13 odcinku z The Book of Unwritten Tales. Dzisiaj już na pewno spróbujemy zrobić, zdobyć znaczy całą tą, no że się nie udało. Zaraz spróbujemy zrobić burzę, to wyjdzie z ta ostatnia część. O kurde. That really wasn't that bad. Okay, good. Two dances. To widzę boki mokę. Już? No to krótki był. A my spaleni leżą. <laughs> Czekajcie cię. Już do was wracam. Idziemy zobaczyć jak to mi ciało. O Jezu. Frankenstein. And you think it's funny seeing me smoke? Yep, everything worked. <laughs> and not for the first time, I'm asking, what's going on with my armor, and where's the? Uh, but of course, you'll find the armor in that grave over there. You ought to wash off that crumbly stuff before you use it, though. Good. And you'll find the sword in the fiery mountain. Okay. Where's that? It's a volcano, not far from here. The dwarves used to have a mine there. They gave it up years ago. But a dragon has recently moved in. Charming. <laughs> a wiecie, który to smok, to ten co na początku Ivo na nim rotował tego. Hey, armor and bits of owner. Before I put it on, I'll polish it and clean the nastiest bits off it. <laughs> Tada! Clothes maketh the man, armor maketh the hero. Yeah, motherfucker. Niech te się mi zjaja mejcem. No gdzie by tu najpierw pójść? Tu pójdziemy najpierw do tych ogrów. O, ale fajnie tak z bliska to teraz widzieć. Mmm, a fair drop. The edges look solid. Excuse me, young sir. May I ask what it is you're hoping to find in our cave? Oh, sorry. I was looking for a public toilet and it smelled a bit like one here. Haha! <laughs> Pleasant. Talk to Blatt about that. He's responsible for personal hygiene this week. Hungry! A to jest serca. No! And unfortunately that's all you think of. Sir, I must ask you to leave our modest dwelling. Okay, I'll look. I'm very much obliged. Many bushes and trees out there would consider themselves most happy to offer their shelter for the call that nature is making to you. Good luck in your search. Hmm, strange plate. That's no plate. That's a shield. Probably the shield I'm looking for. The shield's covered in all kinds of unappetizing ogre food. The ogres don't seem to know that they've been abusing such a valuable object. Hmm, some stone flagons. Whoa, quadruple X. That's really strong. Oh, really? 
Apologies once again, young sir. I cannot countenance your rummaging around in our private things. Please take your leave of our cave. But... Oh, I thought I was in another cave. The two-headed ogre is fat like an ogre. <laughs> and he's got two heads. Hi there, you... There's little human. Proud hungry. Are you a human eater? Hungry! Why, no. You will have to forgive Blout. He's very emotional. <laughs> and he hasn't had anything to eat. <laughs> Hello. Who are you? Blout! Blout, really? My name is Zloth from the Lightning Fist tribe. That's my good for nothing half. Shut up, you brat. You're a battle mage, then, are you? No, hitman. I hit hitman to death. I think he meant me, Blout. It's true, I am a battle mage. My modesty prevents me from pointing out that I am one of the best. Of course, I'd be even better if I could study more. But, uh, oh well. Um, your half brothers? Isn't that a little? Impossible? Not at all. The biology of two-headed ogres is very complex. As you may know, it can... Boring! <laughs> oh. Really? That's just... It's okay. I don't really need to know all the details. That's a very interesting plate there. Dreadful, isn't it? All that fatty food. But Blout loves that rubbish. Route, hungry. I've told you a thousand times. You only get to eat once I've finished reading this book. Hungry, no! If I let you eat now, then you'll put your greasy fi- I get to choose what we do this afternoon. Blout was allowed to decide this morning. First he wanted to lie in, but then suddenly he didn't have enough time to eat. Tough luck. <laughs> I am hungry! Motherfucker. But I am not. <laughs> Could I um borrow the plate? My plate! My plate! I'm sorry, that's Blount's favorite plate. Because it's so big, he won't give you that. I need to get going. Goodbye. <laughs> Apologies once again. Oh! <laughs> Hello, Blount. You, little That's right. <laughs> You must be very hungry, Blout. That's a very, very big plate you've got there. Vada vada. Blout, big, hungry. Why don't you ask Zloth nicely once more if you can eat what's on his plate? Zloth not let me. And Zloth might try lightning. A chum ten my head no cut on ten dva. As long as he's reading that book, you... Uh -huh. Well, you are one smart guy, Blout. Blout? Uh, can't you get Zloth to stop reading? Zloth always reading till book finished. And there's nothing that stops him reading? Zloth like drink cocktails. Ogre cocktails. Okay, and then... He drunk very quick. You mean he can't hold his liquor, and he gets too drunk to keep reading. Hmm, interesting. Do you get drunk fast too, Blout, like Zloth does? No. Blout drink much more than Zloth. Blout real main ogre. But you share the same body. Yeah? So? Oh, nothing. I could make you an ogre cocktail. How would you like that? Blout like beer. Yeah, I know, but the cocktail's mainly for Zloth. Why? So he gets drunk. And th then you can chow down on that snack there. Ooh, okay. <laughs> right. 
What makes a good ogre cocktail? Alcohol. No shit. Alcohol. Okay. And what else? An umbrella. An ogre cocktail is made of nothing but alcohol? And umbrella. And what kind of alcohol? Wine? Vodka? Whatever. Must blow your head off. No, river trip. So, high octane alcohol in a glass with an umbrella. Classy. Little human can look in ca Do you have the ingredients? Uh -huh. You and your half brother. Don't you guys get along too well? Love is stupid. Uh huh. Always reading. Never fun. Never break things. He's more the intellectual type. Sloth, not real man. Sloth never had girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> I heard that. <laughs> I have to leave. My Birch. Birch. Oh, sir, those Blout gave me permission. Little humor, mate. Really? What a delightful surprise. I think no problem, but he meant you. <laughs> that seems to be some kind. No shit. A small, colorful cocktail umbrella. Who'd have thought that there'd be a market for these here in the wildlands? I would have expected a larger cocktail glass. This one's more human-sized. Is that going to be enough to get Zloth drunk? A tied-up linen sack. The contents probably need to be protected from birds and rats. The sack is full to the brim with apples. Hmm, they're all damp and rotten. They smell like they're fermenting. There was some high percentage stuff in there, but the flagons are all empty. I need to find alcohol. A piece of hose, over a meter long and anything but clean. I don't even want to think about what the ogres might use it for. A do tego hippie co dalej nie można iść? Koza. Rude wacki. Jedynka. Pod jedynką mieszkają. O. Hey Thunderhoof. About this lightning dance. Thunderhoof? Hello. Hmm. Bishik. I seem to be out of it. Could be <laughs> something to do with my mushrooms. Take unidentified mushrooms, mixed up with a bunch of suspicious berries and paint, set it on fire, and inhale the smoke. Not. <laughs> Maybe he's uh, just having a little powwow with his ancestors. What the fuck? So let's do it. Let's do this. Mm, tasty. Fermented apple juice. But I'd better not drink it. Oh, really? Skąd żeś w ogóle ten... ten ten, co się trzyma, ten alkohol? If I tip the juice into the hot pot, then every... The alcohol isn't strong enough. The bottles in the cave have... Sits nice and firm. Whatever's in the pot will evaporate, condense. Well, okay. Well, okay. Ah, something's happening. And done.
The bowl has filled up with an almost clear liquid. The alcohol's not strong enough yet for an ogre cocktail, but I can distill it again. And again. That looks a lot better already. Ten that ought to do. Better not. It won't. <laughs> Now just missing the sophisticated decoration. High proof alcohol and a cocktail umbrella. Voila! Voila! Ogre cocktail. Motherfucker. I've got a cocktail for you, Zlop. <laughs> oh, thank you. Wait a minute. You, hmm? you want to get me drunk so I can't read anymore? Us? Never. But you won't get me like that. I'll just take tiny sips. Then I won't get drunk and can continue reading. Ale teraz się zamordować. What? Hungry. Z zlofem może. Better leave him in peace. He might not be too happy with me about the cocktail episode. Good. I'll lay the boards. The rotten boards won't support much weight. One step on them and they'll give way. I'm on a horse, motherfucker. Hello, Blout. You! That's right. And how do you get on with hunting? Have you ever... Not yet. What do you hunt then? Everything. A krylitsk. Uh-huh. I have to... Hold. Będę udawał krylitsk. <laughs> okay then, let's try it. Yeah, colorful, fluffy bunny. Deep stuff, blood. Something's wrong here. The cruelty is empty, murder. A powiedział, teraz muszę rozwalić teraz za cieli krzyż, bo wy nie widzicie, bo to moja kamera jest. A fluffy bunny, I presume. How can it... Go into the corner and be ashamed of yourself. I'll come up with... The way is clear. Jak wy razy widzicie do konta debilu. Niby taki mądry. Got it at last. Finally, you got me. Ah, there. You, you can talk. Sure. You too. Thank you very much for getting me out of there. It's no fun swimming around in hot gravy all day. Then again, it's also no fun being constantly hit by swords and axes. I hope you're not a what? Me? Nah. If you only want to look like one, then that's fine. Just don't fight. The pen is mightier than the sword. And hurts less. Correct. Yeah. Teraz może pójdziemy do jamy smoka. Smok. Are you afraid? I'm okay. <laughs> you should be uh shocked, rigid. <laughs> uh, are you rigid with shock? Uh, not really. What are you reading? How to become a terrifying monster in a fortnight. But I've only just started, and the first chapter states that one should not be disheartened if it doesn't work straight away. And there will always be people who begrudge anyone being successful in business. Sure. 
Cosa ma horse madafaka? A hammer. One side of the head is rounded. This sort of thing is used by a blacksmith. To vezme, nie? A pair of blacksmith's pliers with long handles. To vezme. Kvadu, vezme. An old anvil with dwarven lettering. A mighty thing. Musam, że wezme. The trough is full of water. The smiths probably used it to cool. Hmm, I think this is a coin press. You pour gold, silver, or mithril into the opening and mithril? use the stamp to press the engraving of the coin. Potem napisał Google, może coś takiego się nie... Ale ja mam ludzkie zawiecięcie. Już do was wracam. If there was metal in the mold, I could stamp a coin, provided that the wheel still turns after all the... Huge furnace. Looks to me like they used to smelt metal in it. The furnace isn't going to smelt any metal as unless you poured frozen quicksilver. A stone bowl. The inside of it is black and soot. Spy. My black watch. Hello, gorgeous. Yes. You want to become a fearsome monster? Why? And who are you after all? I am a misunderstood woman in the prime of her life. Uh oh. I have served as a transport dragon for years, but I handed in my notice yesterday. <laughs> there are limits, you know. Did somebody cop a feel? <laughs> I shouted at me only because I lost a load. It was all because of this elf. I should be grateful to her. I can at last strive to reach my full potential, and in as a terror-inducing monster. Yeah, a traditional image for dragons. Men always achieve it, but why shouldn't a woman manage it too? And what's involved in becoming a terror-inducing monster? You've got to pass three exams. Oh no, no! It isn't quite that simple. There is a complicated ten-step plan. I have to develop myself, but it is all so complicated. I am meant to eat maidens, but I'm a vegetarian, <laughs> and I've never spewed fire. I don't have a hoard of gold, and I don't know how to crack open knight's armor. Yeah, and you're not so hot at bellow. I know, but at least I've found a reasonable dragon's den, have I not? I'm looking for a magic sword that's supposed to be hidden here in this mountain. Got any idea where it is? Yes. Yeah? Where then? Oh, yeah. Sh sh well, well, you are somewhat similar to a warrior, and I am a dragon. Sh sh shouldn't we fight or something? Who says so? Chapter five: Overzealous heroes, or. When supper comes knocking at your door. <laughs> That's completely outdated garbage. Do you really think so? For sure. Confrontation won't get you too far these days. You need to find yourself some allies. The magic word is networking. Networking online. There's nothing written here about that. Perhaps. Perhaps you could come back later when I've read a bit more. No. We could, of course, resolve this another way. How? Maybe I could help you to become a terror-inducing monster. Really? You could teach me how to breathe fire. Teach me, teach me how to dig. Teach me, teach me how to dig. Then, then I fear that you'll not be able, unless you perhaps have a huge hoard of. Nah, but I might be able to get you some. As a kind of seed capital, say. <laughs> about one gold coin, for example. Yeah, agreed. Chapter one states that everyone has to start somewhere, and the single gold. Co what kind of a place is this? My dragon's den. Well, yeah, but what was it before? Those machines over there look pretty ancient. The dwarves built them centuries ago. They dug for rare metals in the volcano here. And then the terror rained down on them. A mighty rose-colored dragon drove them away. 
Czemu na tym aso dwie krapki? Do you like the story? I am working on my own legend. Every terror-inducing monster surrounds itself with a web of myths and legends. Hmm. I gotta get. Of course. Of course. Thank you very much. There's a steady stream of lava flowing into the dragon basin. The heat. This hatch keeps the lava in the basin. If you open it with the hatch. Hmm, the dragon is damaged. The head's quite. A gdzie może być ta głowa? Gdzie, gdzie, gdzie może być ta głowa? Gdzie to ja mogę iść? A oni wszystko zabraliśmy sobie? Daj, wszystko. Może coś się skrypcie. Hey boss. Hey boss. Ah. And what kind of a feeling is that being pillory free? It's unusual, but wonderful. I'm not a freak anymore, just a normal run of the mill zombie ghost. Well, I'm pleased for you. I better get going. Take care and to No tam się obudził wreszcie. Spirale. The coals are just. I think my horn friend is off on a spirit far, far away, but we'll be back soon. If there was metal. Hmm, a row of strange stones. They're really smooth and slightly glittery. They probably come from deep inside the mountain. Fuss! Rota! Fuss! Rota! Crystals inside the stone, all sparkling and glinting. Of course. I ought to fire up the furnace. The furnace isn't going to smelt any unless you poured frozen. If I open the hatch now, the lava would pour onto the floor. Hello? Can anybody help me? I think I've gone the wrong way. And there at the front in the passage. Yeah, I've drunk a lot of that sleepwalking potion. So better home. Satan! Welcome to my kingdom, stranger. Whoa! My name's Nate. I'm searching for a powerful warrior set. I'm guessing you're a part of it? Oh, don't remind me. I'm happy to be out of it. The constant riding about, senseless battles, camping in the open, and the cool... What is all this here? And why do you call the mine my domain? <laughs> you could call it good fortune, I suppose. Hey. These completely deranged no, earth no, no, no. found me. They're really into glittery things and wanted to offer me to their god. That ugly thing? Careful. He's vengeful and all powerful. At least that's what I tell these simpletons. I'm the new mouthpiece of their god, you see. I'm their prophet. Because only I can hear what the yes, them. says. What did you say? The Earth Pixies should prepare another warm oil bath for me this evening? Of course, if that is your will, your worshipfulness. <laughs> So you have a nice life here at the Earth Pixie's expense? 
jealous that I got here first. Mm -hmm. But aren't you afraid they'll rumble you? Earth pixies are very simple natured. They never find out. And none of them would dare question the authority of the prophet. You mean the deity himself would have to fire you? Which I would consider pretty unlikely. <laughs> So, much to my regret, I need you. <laughs> I'm serious. You think I've got a screw loose? I'm a god. I'm waited on hand and foot and lead the life of a... I have to insist. Won't take long. A few hours and I'll bring you back. Hands off! God! This human has committed an act of sacrilege. He wanted to molest the deity. <gasps> He's no longer welcome here. Don't let him come back. Ja muszę go to złapać, bo już uciekać. Łoza! Hang on. Hey. Ow. Are you listening? Ow, ow. Not nice. Get off. Get off. Hey, 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 you. Hey, whoo. Keep your freaking little hands off my ghoulies. <laughs> Their little hands were all over me. Chyba wiesz co to znaczy To jest jedyne takie miejsce gdzie Kurde jakoś się tak ojdzie The trough is full to the brim with mountain water This is probably where the earth pixies The trough Urwi? Uza! Tak jak można zamordować kolegę, bo ci zabronić. Dynamite. You have to ask yourself how Earth Pixies get their hands. My arrows must be solid. Whoa! Lepiej tam nie idź po łza. Jak łza! Cię zabiję! Łza! Czy jest dzielna mi to frezę? Pytam się. Chcesz? Ten Wacek pewnie się w kogoś już nie ma miejsca. Nie słyszę mnie w ogóle. Ha, 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 ha. Jestem taki zły. Myszka zawalił, gnajk. O, ty ruda pała, zginiesz. Tak, do myszka mi zabrałeś. Łusa. W Rima, a masz. A masz. Ty gnoju, rudy ty. Out of the way. Debil. The shaft leads deep down into the mountain. There's a little glimmer of light down there. Maybe even more earth pixie. I definitely can't. Shouldn't be to them. A wooden chest with steel bed. Oh, I could have detected. It fits. Oh hell yeah. Hmm. There are some stones in. Hey, the stones are pulling each other. They must be magnetic. I don't need any more. See. Okay, so what did I just do? Just 
ראש, לא, זה מה שם. תדינאות. מקס, משיש. A small fire. The pixies warm the... A small fire. What the... Tom, Tom, Tom. You goddamn stink mother sons of bitches! Yaki Pavit! Yaki Tipo! Ale urwa! To mi się podobało! Torch is lighting up the whole passage. What gives it? Pump on him! Pump on him, go! Rudy. Both ages, this Rudy. Uza! It's some kind of water skin or camel bag. They're usually made from... Jakuza mnie zobaczyła! A! Na posy trochę wszklina. You goddamn stink mother f***** sons of bitch! A lubi już go. Typ. Bejko, patrz, patrzcie na jego nogę. Widzieliście jego nogę? Ten dance, ten dance, te, te ruchy ciała, te, kurde, te. Widzieliście to? Jak mogliście tego nie widzieć? Okej. Okay. Dudi, 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 w dupę, w dupę, w dupę, w dupę. Ure, tupe to nie gynie. Bomba! Uza! Uza! Motherfucker, Rudy. This torch isn't fixed to the bracket. I'm leaving the stick. Pochodnie się chyba podpalało ognieniem tamtym. Stój bo, jakuza! If I'm going to light the... So let's do it. Check on me. Check on me, I'm going to see you next time. I'm going to see you next time. Oh, I'm going to see you next time. Ogarnął. O, co za debi? A im to wisi, nie? Ale my już to zrobimy w kolejnym odcinku, więc co było na tyle w tym odcinku? Wiecie, że wam się spodobał? Zapraszam was do innych serii, mówi dla was Maxi. Cześć!